this made taro sadder than ever sadder here we are using the comparative degree okay the form of adjective of sad this made taro sadder than ever for the heart warming drink called sake was very expensive because sake was very expensive and he was unable to purchase that because of poverty then what happened next morning taro jumped out of bed earlier than usual and made his way to the forest taro here he woke up early from the usual time and make and walk towards the forest he chopped and cut what do you mean by chopped here chopped means repeated sharp blows of an axe or knife to cut something okay as you can see on your screen he was cutting here a tree he chopped and cut the tree here his mouth was dry because of hard working his mouth become very dry and his face was wet with sweat means his face was full of wet with sweat okay here uh, he was speaking direct speech as a column is given here what he was thinking here my poor old father if only he was as warm as i what he was thinking here that my poor old father if only he was as warm as i uh, so he was just to hope that my father could be as warm as i okay so in the third column suddenly taro stopped chopping he heard the sound of rushing water suddenly he stopped the chopping he uh, he stopped chopping and cutting okay and uh, what he heard he heard the sound of rushing water rushing means here moving quickly or creating sound he was hearing a sound of rushing water which was come from the behind the rock okay and he ran in the direction of that sound from where they are coming so again that is the direct speech which is which is spoken by the tarot what he was speaking here could it be could it be, it possibly be rushing water means he was thinking that here could it be possible rushing water be there so in the fourth para tarot saw a beautiful waterfall hidden behind a rock what he saw there he saw a very beautiful waterfall which is hidden behind a rock and what he was doing there he kneeling he cupped a little in his hands and put it to his lips kneeling means bending down on knees taro now after this taro when he saw a waterfall beautiful that uh, waterfall he wants to drink that so, so he Uh, bending down his knees so he bending down his knees uh, he cupped a little in his hands he cupped cupped means here uh, held in hand by making the shake of a ball so he wants to drink and nothing he has having so what he was he he make a ball uh, with the help of his hand and put it to his lips for drink okay now here in direct speech again i can't believe this waterfall has delicious sake instead of water what here what he saw he saw that it's not a normal water i can't believe here i can't believe here is you can see that exclamatory sign is uh, they are using it means it's the exclamatory sign uh, sudden uh, sorrow expression if they are in your sentence okay so this waterfall has a delicious sake instead of water that means it it's not a normal water it's a sake it's a sake okay instead of water so 